Hello, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Today's date, it is June 12th of 2019. Uh, a few hours ago, my daughter on the grill outdoors, my grown daughter who lives next door, made gigantic, I should have got the, because I took a couple pictures, gigantic steaks for us all. And so, and mashed potatoes and gravy and uh, corn. So, I am full. This is just going to be a general show me blog or Howard's notebook. It's going to be a, a blog. And I don't have any notes, and I never take notes, and I should, but I haven't done it since. Uh, I've never taken notes. So I doubt I'll start, but I should. Um, I'm almost up to three, well, I've been this way for years. I'm trying really hard to get to 3,000 subscribers. There's something I'd really like to get to. It would be 30,000 subscribers because right now you need 30,000 subscribers for this community uh, channel that you can have and uh, memberships and all types of uh, all types of things. But I, I'm never going to make it to 30,000 subscribers. I can't even get to 3,000 subscribers. After, let's see, well, I started with YouTube when they Hello. started, and that was 2005. I was doing videos and stuff before 2005, but they started in 2005, and I haven't made it to 3,000 subscribers yet, which is kind of disappointing because there's a number of YouTubers that I remember when they started out after I did, and in the beginning, uh, several of them, you know, made uh, comments about, hey, you know, this guy Jim Howard, he's been making, you know, YouTube videos, or been online since, you know, 1980, you know, whatever, and, they, and <laughs> they've, they've left me in the dust, so that's what's kind of sad about the whole thing. Uh, but, I mean, you have to do something that uh, people are interested in. And of course, there's always a niche. For, you know, uh, we've all got our favorites. You can see here, you know, I like the PBS NewsHour, of course, and I like the entire Twit network, and I like this uh, Chinese uh, lady I've talked about. I think I showed a little bit of her video, uh, the first Ring Daily. Today I found out the top ten. Uh, I'm not sure. Great big story. I'm not too sure about uh, Bo of the Fifth Column. <laughs> I never thought I would act because when you see him, I, I looked at him and I thought, you know, hey, racist, redneck, or whatever. And I just judged him just by, uh, and he makes fantastic videos. I highly recommend, uh, highly recommend. Well, let's just go ahead and click on it. I uh, highly recommend he just does an excellent job. And he has 127,000 subscribers. Oh, no. Now, I just happened to, let's see, uh, this young lady in China has 881,000 subscribers. She is a hard worker, and, and I, I just can't imagine, especially in you know, I, my uh, youngest son. He's been to China twice, and then my grandson's been to China once. I know, really, you know, I mean, what I know about China is from the news and and YouTube videos and that type of stuff. But uh, she walks around China like you know this main this. Uh, city that the Chinese built up for technology and for whatever and she she has she walks around like this dressed like this 
and with a 360, I showed you that the other day, you know, with 360 degree camera. They don't cost very much. I could get one, but I don't do any walking or moving around, unfortunately. But uh, anyway, as you can see, um, and actually the amount of revenue that I've been taking in has, it's going down. And I'm sure that's because when I talk politics, which I don't really want to talk politics, but I've ever since 1982, or even before that, back, uh, I, I did a radio program, a shortwave radio program that was broadcast to Europe, Africa, and Latin America. And I've always been, uh, and then I put out a publication, a couple of publications or whatever back then, on a, like one on a mimeograph machine. 500 copy and I've always been outspoken honest and open to uh, other points of view or whatever but um, and too whatever like when my blog which is the written blog which from 1982 to well, just a few years ago even though even in 1995 when I moved to the World Wide Web I still kept the uh, Printed one, and uh, that you know the uh, well on YouTube, you know face or uh, I hate Facebook, um, you know WordPress or well in the beginning I Live Journal, whatever you know, I tried all of them. I was there when they began, Live Journal. Uh, what are all the other? I went through all of them. Ended up with years and years and years of you know WordPress, and. Uh, it just got where, you know, nobody's, you know, going to it, and I can understand it. You know, this is the digital, well, even though that's digital, you know. But uh, anyway, uh, when I was blogging or whatever it is, it's whatever is on my mind, and, you know, if it back many years ago, what, 40 years ago, whatever, or how long have I been divorced? It was, you know, the marriage going to hell. I blogged about that. Uh, uh, when I worked, you know, at certain, when I worked at a hospital, I did grievances. I posted my grievance, you know, on the my, my blog. And then when I won the grievances, I posted that I won and what the, you know, and it is, but then if I was interested, whatever, I'm, I mean, just, you know, movies, amateur radio, then that's what I talk about. So, but I'm, I've always been a news person. Uh, and, you know, politics, the first president I voted for had to vote by absentee ballot for John F. Kennedy because I went to welding school. I was in welding school in Cleveland, Ohio. Um, so I had to vote by absentee ballot there. Uh, but, man, I don't like politics anymore. I just, but then on the other thing, it affects, you know, you see the headlines. And it's like, you know, uh, I, I would, I wish I had won a lottery or something. I don't buy lottery tickets. I mean, I have in the past, you know, one, when I, uh, one ticket when, <laughs> when it's a gigantic, uh, thing, but, I, but I mean, I just wish I could have or could win a lottery and just leave all of this and just go to like New Zealand, maybe. I wouldn't go to Australia, although, you know, what I've seen about it, because, of, man, Australia has every poisonous, deadly creature, you know, from little tiny, uh, <laughs> little tiny creatures to, you know, so I think I'd go to New Zealand right now, it's about as far away from the United States as you can get, but anyway, uh, here when I, and I'm not trying to make money with YouTube, I enjoy doing it, but I would like I spend more than I make. You know, I know that because I pay.
pay for what YouTube Red, I pay for YouTube, uh, whatever that thing is to help YouTubers, you know, and and uh, it would be nice to, but I'm not doing it for the money. But uh, you can see my uh, aquarium there in the background. I've out of I about three weeks ago, you know, I bought some fish for the 20 gallon tank and out of the five Coriodorus, little Coriodorus catfish, uh, three have died, <laughs> only two survivors. Then there's a couple of Placostomus in there, they're doing great. I love my, my, my snails, I've always loved snails. My wife and I had a tropical fish shop in Kansas City, Missouri for Four years, I think. I can't remember now. That like the 1970s or the late 1960s. I can't remember now how many years it was. See, one year at that one location. Then we moved to another location. I think we were there for a year. And I think we moved to the other location. We were there. You know, all these are right down the street from each other. I think we were there, too. Anyway, uh, I've got this coming. I have an aquarium filter in there now, you know, one on the back of the tank, 20 gallon tank, but I'm going to go ahead and get, I have got this coming on the way. I placed a very small order with um, Amazon and, and I tried to adjust them, you know, I'm not, I wasn't in any hurry and it might as well come the same day, but it, the way uh, I got next day delivery on $3 and 30 cents of tubing and then I got two separate orders in the same day and then I've got the order for this is coming I think Friday and uh, this is going to take up you know a little bit of room in this tank this sponge filter but um, I may take the one off the back of the, you know, the one on the back of the tank, I may take it off. I'm not sure. Let's see, how come that's there twice? I don't know. Here's the pump I got. Uh, I think I got that today. Yeah. It has two air outlets on it. One of the things that's supposed to be quiet, it's not really, but it, it quieted down after I made sure I had, you know, both of these air things were... Uh, coming off. So now I've got two air stones in the uh, tank. And the fish and the, even the snails seem a little bit happier to me. I thought there was plenty of circulation with the, you know, the filter on the back pumping water out and a uh, pretty good thing, but I think they uh, definitely, I think they seem happier to me. I am a fish psychologist now, I guess. So, uh, very very good price for this thing. Of course, I don't know anything about price. I mean, the last I was looking was in the, back in the late 60s, you know, when they sold fish and plants and uh, hardware for the stuff. So, this came today in a separate, you know, separate order or whatever. I hooked, you know, both of the air things coming out of the uh, air pump. I hooked both of those in to, you know, tied them in together, of course, and then put them into this. So you got that up on a, just, you know. I mentioned the other day, and I still have, uh, not getting the speed that, and no changes were made. You know, I don't, I didn't, I didn't check, you know, the speed every, um, actually I can show that I think here, recent history. Uh, I, you know, I didn't, uh, I didn't check every day or anything. And uh, 
So you can see that, wait a minute here, download, here you go, well, here it happened about, see there's no, I didn't buy any new hardware, I didn't buy any new network cards, I, uh, I always, when I'm really trying to get that course, I always shut down, you know, well, kind of, kind of hard now because my ex-wife, but anyway, uh, is always, you know, watching Netflix or something like that. But now it's, uh, I don't know, something's happened and it has nothing to do with, uh, you know, like new network cards or cabling or, and I, of course, we're hooked in here to, um, you know, directly wired in. Uh, Although we have Wi-Fi, well, now my son in the next room, he's, you know, he's using a, his Wi-Fi, and he doesn't have a very good wife, but I'm talking about here myself, really. So, this, uh, I wonder if this could have something to do with, yeah, you know, this would actually fall right when a big windstorm came through. Dallas Fort Worth area and did and they're still today let's see today's the 12th and I think this happened on the 10th or whatever or the 9th no I started on the 10th and uh, we lost our power for about an hour but it's been so I think it has something to do with that that for some reason, you know, part of Dallas, you know, lost power and part of Fort Worth, we got it back. But uh, I think it's got something to do with that. I don't know whether they have to, if they rerouted something, uh, if something was taken out or whatever. So I'm hoping that uh, this is going to come back because I'm paying $125 a month for internet service. Now 25 of that is, or 20 is for uh, a telephone service for uh, Darlene. I just use, uh, I just use a cell phone. So I think that's it, but it's kind of aggravating. That's a lot of money to pay for, and we've been getting, as you can see, which I've been perfectly happy with, you know, uh, 380, 391, 342 down, all these 465 down. Uh, well, here's a spell of bad too, but uh, so I don't know what's going on. Uh, so, um, So here are my videos. Oh, that's what I was saying is that, you know, uh, the amount of money in, is coming down, you know, is, I'm making less on YouTube instead of more. Uh, but you can see here, you know, I turned off the ability to make money on this because I talked about uh, the... Uh, uh, so talk, you know, I talked about the, yeah, you know, the not so much so much the shooting there in Florida, but the uh, recent charging of the police officer with criminal negligence and that kind of stuff. And uh, well, here, well, here's another one I turned off where I talked about uh, political matters. Here's another one I turned off. And here's a. Uh, one, two, two in a row that I turned off. And this one, they turned off. For some reason, me talking about, well, I wonder if that was, uh, if, because I talked about this microphone, but it may be that I rambled on to some subject after that, which I shouldn't do, I should I should limit it to one. 
one thing. So anyway, that one, Amazon turned it off, saying that the uh, content was not suitable. This video is running limited or no ads due to content identified as not suitable for most advertisers. It remains fully playable and is eligible for, you know, subscription revenue or whatever. I don't think, right, I think it's now called YouTube Premium. Uh, that's a good way for you to support uh, people. If, I think it's like, what, $10 a month? I forget. If you pay it, you it, it does away. You don't see advertising in the uh, YouTube videos that you see. And YouTube divides the, well, they take, you know, I don't know how much, 30% or whatever. And then they uh, divide it up among all the other YouTubers. And, of course, they divide it up depending on how many views you get or how much, you know, so... Cutie Pie or whatever his name is, the guy in Sweden, you know, he gets, you know, so they don't divide it up equally. That'd be neat if they did, you know, uh, but that wouldn't be fair, you know. Anyway, uh, thank you very much for watching. I'm going to bring this to a conclusion and upload it, and maybe the next video will be better. Thank you for watching.